In conventional orthogonal projection, we have a front elevation and all the other faces go off at 90 degrees to it. Occasionally we have a component with a major surface that is inclined to at least one of the principal planes, but a feature of, print, of primary auxiliary views is that the surface must be 90 degrees to at least one of the principal planes. The component we've got here is in boundary figure 4.5. Here we show the front elevation, which the primary face is at 90 degrees to. And over here we have a view from the, from the right. We've used the mixing bowl technique to, try to project it over here. And you can see that that primary surface, that major surface, is uh, very distorted. It, you could not manufacture it from that, from that view. We need to get the, the true shape of that surface. So again, using the, the revolving technique, uh, if we project off from that face and twist it round on that face here, we've got the, the true surface of that object. The principle of of, of the primary auxiliary view is that we project off from that surface that's at right angles to the to this view. We we project off at 90 degrees all those points, and we using dividers we step off the, the distances in that direction from equivalent distances in that view. The actual mechanics of it are all included in boundary with figure 4.5.